I don't know, people. I don't know. I've just been looking through all the Thanksgiving posts and everything that just popped up on my feed. And I'm seeing some really negative shit out here. Thanksgiving is for giving thanks. Today, on Real with Robo, we're going to talk about people that can't give thanks. For anything, there are people starving out there on the streets right now. There are people out there with no food, no clothes, no home, no nothing. And you have the nerve to sit in whatever kind of home you have. A roof over your head. You know, warmth and food on your table. No matter what it is. I don't care if all you could afford was mashed potatoes. And that's all that you have for Thanksgiving dinner. At least you eating. You could be grateful. Then I see another post saying, you know, how this holiday traumatized, you know, certain people. Holidays don't traumatize certain people. The only people they traumatize are negative ass people like you. All right. You talking about something that happened over 200 years ago. What you had to do with it? How can we fix it? We can't fix it. It's in the past. So what the fuck you want me to do? Be miserable on Thanksgiving Day while I'm surrounded by my family and my loved ones and in a nice warm home? It's a lot different than being homeless. It's a lot different than not knowing when you're going to eat again. And it's a lot different than doing all those things while you're pregnant. So what you talking about? Oh, the horrors of this holiday. You don't even know what horrors are. You don't even know what trauma really is. All you know is that you a miserable ass cunt and you want everybody else to be miserable with you. But, 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 I'm, I'm one of those new people that are protesting. I'm protesting. Well, if you protesting, protest by yourself over there away from people that are trying to celebrate. Go protest by yourself, you miserable bitch. For real. And this goes for dudes too, not just females. I'm so sick and tired of the ungratefulness. There are people currently that are serving across the seas and even at our borders that don't get to spend their Thanksgiving with their families. There are people that are dead and in the ground from fighting in wars that still ain't made it home. That fought to protect your ungratefulness. There are people living today in their homes who can't bear Celebrating Thanksgiving because their minds and their hearts are so hurt around these holidays. And you have the nerve, you have the audacity, you have the gall to be ungrateful. Won't you be grateful for them people? Won't you be grateful that they're giving up their lives, their happiness, their holidays for your ungrateful ass while you stuff that turkey down your throat and sit there with your loved ones? Won't you think about the people on the street that have no one, that have no home, that have no food in their belly, that have no warmth. And if you really want me to be a bitch about it, why don't you be grateful that you didn't have to experience that shit as a child? Because there are children that are homeless. Y'all about the most ungrateful motherfuckers I have ever seen in my damn life. In my damn life, you have a roof over your head. Be grateful. You woke up this morning. Be grateful. You ain't got pain like a lot of us have. Be grateful. But instead, you want to cry about the past. You want, oh, oh, because, you know, 200 and some odd years ago, uh, the white man came and they desecrated the land. Uh. And what I'm going to do about it? What are you going to do about it? What, you gonna make a time machine so we can hop in it and go make it right? You That'd dumb. Be That'd be fun. You dumb. 
I guess there's a lot of people crying out there about, I just don't understand why these people are so dumb. There, you could go be miserable with them. But for right now, I'm giving thanks for your dumb ass. Because it always brings me a giggle when I'm thinking, okay, so what are we about to do about this? We can't do nothing about it. You can't do nothing about it. And most of the people that you're crying and complain about, complaining about have gotten over it in the past uh, 200 and some odd years. Believe me, if they can get over it, so can you. Why don't you set a place at your table to ever, to be ever mindful of the people that can't be with their loved ones? Why don't you be grateful for that? That they give a fuck enough about your ungrateful crybaby. Oh, let's be miserable. Let's find something to be miserable about these holidays, ass. And be grateful for that. As far as Christmas go, I apologize profusely from the bottom of my motherfucking heart all the way to, to the bottom of my motherfucking soul that a Christian holiday celebrating our Lord Jesus Christ's birthday hurts your fucking feelings that much. Where you have to cry and bitch me. Oh, I can't say Merry Christmas because I don't believe in it. That's funny. Back in the day, I knew a lot of Jehovah Witnesses that'll tell me Merry Christmas in a heartbeat. And they don't celebrate that shit. But you want to be a bitch about it. Uh, you're forcing your religion on me. Nobody wants you in our religion. You about a miserable motherfucker. Do you think, do you think we want you in our religion? No, we don't. But since we getting all PC about it, I ain't going to say happy holidays to anybody. I'm going to tell you Merry motherfucking Christmas. And if you can't say Merry motherfucking Christmas back, then you in the wrong. Let's go by your rules. You in the wrong. You offending me as a Christian. Now what you got to say about it? Not much, huh? You ain't talking no more bullshit about that. Go be ungrateful somewhere else. Let's take a moment to remember the horrors of these holidays. How about you take a moment and be fucking grateful for what you have? How about you take a moment and be grateful for what people have given you and been able to enjoy these holidays with your loved ones while they can? How about you be grateful that you not all buried in some far off motherfucking country cold and in the ground and ain't made it home yet. Won't you be grateful for that? Oh wait, that's right. You people that cry all the time about bullshit, you can't be grateful for nothing. Because there's always got to be some kind of uh, uh, I'm not a Christian. I can't say Merry Christmas because then people might actually think I'm a Christian. Oh my God. And they'll try, they'll try and force their religion down my throat. No, we won't. Honestly, to be frank and real with Robo, no one gives a fuck what you believe in. And don't nobody want your monkey ass in my motherfucking religion anyway. I do me, you do you, over there, away from me, stop being negative. Try being thankful. And if you really need a reason to be thankful, be thankful you're not me. Be thankful that you don't have to wait months on end to get some kind of pain relief. Be thankful you don't wake up like me every day. Be thankful that you don't wake up like some of my friends every day with no one. Be thankful that you have people that care about you, that you have good doctors, that you have that turkey on your table. Be thankful about that because in a blink of an eye, shit can go awry.
Be thankful for what you have. Because there's a lot of people out there that don't have that. There's a lot of people out there that know how it feels not to have that. And you make us fucking sick. You offend me by being ungrateful. And I don't get offended often. But I'm offended now. And that's real with Robo.